The B-21 Raider, the U.S. Air Force's next-generation stealth bomber, has achieved notable milestones in its development, with three prototypes actively participating in flight and ground testing as of early 2025. The first aircraft, T-1, is undergoing rigorous flight tests at Edwards Air Force Base, California, to evaluate its aerodynamics, stealth capabilities, and advanced avionics. Two additional prototypes are focused on structural integrity and systems integration trials, ensuring compatibility with future weapons and technologies. Northrop Grumman, the bomber's manufacturer, plans to expand the test fleet with three more Raiders to accelerate validation across diverse operational scenarios. The B-21 incorporates cutting-edge stealth features, including advanced materials and contouring, to reduce its radar cross-section beyond that of the B-2 Spirit. Its open architecture design allows seamless integration of emerging technologies, such as hypersonic munitions, enhancing its standoff strike capabilities. While its payload capacity is slightly smaller than the B-2s, analysts project its operational range to match or exceed 6,900 miles, bolstered by survivability in contested airspace. The bomber's sixth-generation avionics and digital engineering processes have enabled rapid progress in flight testing, with two flights per week reported in late 2024. The program transitioned to low-rate initial production, LRIP, in 2024, with Northrop Grumman securing a second LRIP contract by early 2025. Though exact numbers remain classified, initial LRIP batches may cover up to 21 aircraft, with plans to expand the fleet from 100 to 200-200 units to meet long-term strategic demands. The fiscal year 2025 defense budget allocates $2.6 billion for procurement and $282 million for infrastructure at Ellsworth Air Force Base, a future B-21 hub. Unit costs are estimated at $692 million, significantly lower than the B-2's inflation-adjusted price. Recent milestones include the completion of structural integrity tests and the start of fatigue testing to ensure airframe durability. Flight tests have demonstrated high-altitude performance, with one November 2024 sighting prompting social media comparisons to a ghost due to its stealth profile. Collaboration between Northrop Grumman and the Air Force's Rapid Capabilities Office has streamlined development, leveraging digital twins and agile manufacturing. Slated for service entry as early as 2026, the B-21 will gradually replace the B-1 Lancer and B-2 Spirit, becoming the cornerstone of U.S. nuclear and conventional strike capabilities. Its combination of survivability, range and adaptability positions it as a key asset in countering advanced adversaries, with proponents arguing it could offset delays in the next-generation air dominance fighter program. <laughs>